Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we are looking at Azure Firewall, which is a, a managed cloud-based network security service that protects your uh, Azure virtual network resources. So the way it works is you're going to set up a VNet, which is a virtual network, and you're going to attach that firewall. And you're going to use it as a point of entry for all your traffic. And then what you're going to do is you're going to have spoke VNet. So when I say spoke, I just mean other virtual networks that you've created um, that are intermediate uh, to your traffic. So the traffic is going to pass through that VNet into those other ones. And our VNet with the firewall is going to decide what traffic is allowed to flow through and what's not to which other VNets that have specific virtual machines so that we get protection. Uh, but let's talk about some of the features of the Azure firewall. So the first thing is you uh, you centrally create, enforce, uh, it centrally creates, enforce, and uh, logs application network connectivity policies across subscriptions and virtual networks. So subscriptions being multiple accounts. Uh, uses a static public IP address for your virtual network resources, allowing outside firewalls to identify traffic originating from your virtual network. That's very useful. High availability is built in uh, at no additional cost, so you don't have to uh, uh, create load balancers and do all that work yourself. Uh, you can cr uh, configure uh, you can configure it during de deployment to span multiple AZs so that it has high availability. There's no additional cost for a firewall deployed in an availability zone. Uh, there's an additional cost for inbound and outbound data transfers associated with AZs, which uh, is 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 uh, typical. So there you go.